I'm not all there today. Gosh, this is how my week is starting, like this. <sighs> oh boy, oh boy. There's not even a plant in there. It died weeks ago. such a long time and every time I get in the pool it's as if I don't know what I'm doing I couldn't I couldn't show you it was too embarrassing <laughs> I'm so hungry so I'm gonna start cooking dinner oh, I don't know what it is is it that whole 30 minute thing where you're not supposed to before you swim is that a real thing but maybe it's a good thing because I had I made lunch dinner before I went out there I might not have swam because by the end of it it was breezy oh I know that this long weekend marks the end of summer, at least in my mind, but dang, it's feeling a lot like fall out there. Okay, maybe that's an exaggeration. Anyway, I'm gonna put some leave-in in my hair and then we're gonna get to making fajita bowls with black bean rice. <laughs> Got my iPod, not my iPod, girl, that's a relic. <laughs> I forgot my AirPods at home. I'm not going back for it. Plus, I'm only gonna be on the subway for a couple stops until I get to my friend's house. Just gonna go to a little barbecue. Figure it is a long weekend, so I should be sociable, no? So let's go. There's definitely more than enough food for me. Good morning! It's a holiday Monday and it was so hard getting out of bed. You don't even understand how exhausted I was. But I'm up now and I'm doing some laundry just before I do my gym sesh. That way by the time I'm done in the gym, my laundry will be done too. I'm trying to kill two birds with one stone. literally having dreams of laundry and I'm like, okay, if you're dreaming about it, just get up and do it. But I really didn't want to get up today. You don't even understand. Me wearing this is so weird. I mean, I got it for free, but... <laughs> Where's my card? Okay. I just realized... Uh-oh. I'm not all there today. Hey Siri, set timer for 31 minutes. Don't let a nice place be you anywhere can have a tea. What I want to know is why does that dryer smell like pee? Like what are you doing for a dryer to smell like pee? This one got me off my 
So productive and it isn't even 11 yet. It isn't even 11 yet. It isn't even 11 yet. Okay, let me not do this on the bed because I want to make the bed. Ugh. Every month, switch out the sponge sometime sooner depending on. I love these white sponges. I need to find a new place to buy them since I told you guys in the last vlog. They're discontinued now. Okay, so today we're going to do a Daphne protein powder even though, truth be told, where is it? Forever, ever, 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 ever. You're supposed to take protein powder half an hour after your workout. It's been two hours. Okay, so let's just do, do I want strawberry banana again? No, let's do pineapple. Pineapple on pineapple on pineapple. We'll do, oh, is my avocado ready yet? Because I would love an avocado almond milk, almond butter smoothie. Donut. I feel like this is so close. My head's not cut off. Ooh, I could get away with it. It's like a holiday Monday to me. Maybe because I have so much planned today. So much work, boring stuff that I'm not gonna put you guys through. But things I gotta get done. I wish I could have fun in the sun. Summer is too fleeting for it to not be hot, 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 hot. Hot, hot, da 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 If you know that song, let me know down below. There's an app that I think Twitter acquired and basically, you hear the first second, one second of a song, and you're supposed to guess what it is. On the floor, I just cleaned. That happens all the time, if you know what I mean. This piece just doesn't want to come out. I'm source reasons. I love this thing. I got it from Urban Outfitter. Half the things in my house are from Urban Outfitter. They should have their own home store, but I guess the online thing works well enough. Look. Containers, in containers, in containers. How clutch is that? I've seen people do this online to get the, the seed out. I'm just afraid of losing my hand. If you knew my vlogs, you're probably wondering, why are they so choppy? It's because a lot of times I'll ramble and then I'll say something and I'm like, mm, you guys don't need to know that. So I'll edit it out. Don't know if I should film a TikTok and a YouTube video. I'm wondering if I should do one or the other. TikToks take a really long time. They take longer to set up than a youtube video because once you set the camera up you're good to go tiktoks you have to stop check make sure the snapping one i did a couple weeks ago <laughs> we're not going to talk about that and the snaps were still off in the end and i had someone help me get it on beat on tempo and it was still off tempo these are the only dates i like i hate first dates guys it's the worst thing on the planet I like going out to eat once you've gotten acquainted with somebody, but the first date, mm -mm. I don't know how people love going on 50 first dates. Free meals? Nah, I can pay for my own meals to avoid. Actually, I won't put this in there because there's protein in the almond butter. So all the people who are standing on the outside need to come inside, fill up the spot so we can get you moving. They're shy. They're, they're really shy today. Don't be shy today. Don't be shy. You don't have to be shy. We're good to go. So you listen to the sounds of Pan Fantasy Steel Band if you just joined us. was already intense as it was so i put on my like songs because i don't have playlists on spotify and yo i forgot that i like some of the songs they're really getting me in the mood it sucks because i feel like summer's half done and now i'm in that summer party vibe oh well whatever i'm gonna go get back to work that was a nice three hour break from doing what i was doing before but now it's time to get serioso oh i'm so thirsty i need to get a bigger purse so I can put my swell bottle in and pack water when I'm on my long walks. I was like, oh, I'm gonna get a nice coffee. And then when I left, I didn't feel like it. 
It's so weird. I just turned this off. That's a wrap. The best thing about doing my pods in one take is I saved hours, okay? Because sometimes in order to get the right everything, especially when that fridge goes on, I do not want to admit, but I'm going to admit, the time that I was up until 2 a.m. and I started potting at 7 and that pod was like 8 minutes or something, so I don't know what she was doing that night in November, but never again. After that, I said, I don't care. There's no topic that is worth staying up to 2 a.m. <laughs> so I'm done potting, which is perfect, and so I can edit it, have it ready for tomorrow morning. I like this little, I forgot that it changes every month. When I first set this up for my Google Calendar, the backdrop, I thought that it would be every month has a different one. So if I go back to July, it's gonna have like that white marble look that I had back then. But I didn't realize that instead of that, Google <laughs> just changes all of them. So when I opened it, I was like, am I on the wrong page? And I'm like, oh yeah, because I did this back in January. So I don't even remember what, this one is August. I don't know what September through to December looks like, but it'll be a surprise when I get there. It's definitely something I want to keep up because it's just aesthetic. That's the word I really overuse. Anywho, I love how it went from super sunny to tsunami. Literally, the weather, weather, went 180. Bend it like Beckham exorcism type ish because I heard pitter pattering while I was recording. And I was like, please, God, let it not pick up the rain. Or me breathing so deeply because sometimes this microphone gets <laughs> okay maybe it doesn't sound like that that's an exaggeration but that's what it feels like to me so yeah that's my monday night i'm going to i probably shouldn't meal prep but i don't want to you know those days i just want to be lazy and show i watched a couple vlogs i feel like i should have left that for later tonight i want to see that movie nope but i'm afraid that it's a horror movie and your girl doesn't do that so I'll blow it. So calm down, calm down. Roll to the outer left hip. Down there. Take a breath in. And see if you can lift your hips, scoot your right leg back, hold as far Ooh. forward as you can, Ooh. and then Ooh. start to round into the back. Drop your to the left side. You can start to turn your gaze up towards the sky. Roll all the way back and down. This Tuesday is really trying me. First of all, I had some wow, 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 wow dreams. You know those vivid dreams you wake up and you're like, I'm so grateful that's not real life, but why does my mind go that way? And it's about real life situations too. So I don't know if my subconscious is trying to process, but I'm not here for it. Then I did my yoga workout, which helped me get grounded. But why is it when I come out of the shower, I'm like, what's this on my head? Do you see this? Why do I have a knot on my head? Like when Nikki threw the shoe at Cardi, where did this come from? Let me just make my breakfast and mind my business because I'm not trying to have no bad day today. I want to have a good day today. I've been a blow up the sex in a uh -huh. the Where's my phone? Oh, I'm going to have to go get me. The song never gets cold. Okay, let me put all of these away i figured the day after a long weekend i need to be productive this vibe this whole week is productivity i was imagining myself chilling by the pool after and i was like no not until you work but then this the knot in my head i have the perfect idea for a tiktok with the rihanna song not the one i'm humming along to but i don't know if i can do it because if this shows is a no-go no 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 Oh, no. Glad I didn't lose my sweater this time around. I've had this one for more than 10 years. A lot of my pieces I've kept in good condition, even if they were cheap. My passion fruit juice, I'm so excited. I haven't had guava or passion fruit in so long, so I was like, which one should I get? Because I have the worst habit of having juice in my fridge and for, ooh, speaking of, I need to drink this. It's because I don't really drink juice by itself anymore.
my gym sesh was just all right. I thought about filming it in case you guys want to know how I do my ab routine. Then I didn't bring my camera downstairs, so you know what I mean. Anywho, today on the roster, I got a few nails chopped off. I don't know if I'm going to go in for a fill. I think I should because that's what I told them. Or if I should get them to take it all off and just do a simple shellac. It depends on how long they take because you know how long they took to do this. So that's what we're going to go do. I'll bring my mask too. You never know. You don't want to make people feel uncomfortable, right? And today is only 19 degrees. It's giving September teas, which I'm not happy or here for. Where's summer comeback? I want to go for as well. Oh gosh, that's how it is in Toronto. You never know what you're going to get. You never know what you're going to get. I bet you anything next week is going to be hot, hot, hot. I hope, fingers crossed. So after I go to get my nails, filled, which I've never got a fill before in my life, so let's see how that goes, but I can't keep them this long. I broke a gold chain. Typos are insane, as if they weren't bad before. That's already two good reasons to get these cut off. I'm going to go to the pharmacy and pick up the prescription from last week to help with this thing because it's really, really bothering me. I can't believe she thinks it came from tape. What? This stupid prescription better not be too expensive, eh? A lot of people who are American or overseas, when I talk to them, they're like, oh, you're so lucky your healthcare is free. The same Switzerland, the same Sweden, it is not free here in Canada. It is free to have a consultation. Everything thereafter, you gotta pay. For example, last week, not last week, technically, last month, I spent about $500 in medical stuff. Prescriptions for my acne medication, tests. Unless you are covered, which I've only been covered when I was in university under my mom and then for a couple months with a really bad plan with my last employer, SOL. That's one thing I hated about my undergrad when the privileged girls in my class, because let's be honest, it was pretty much female dominant. There was like three guys in my course, my whole program. They would always say, oh, health is a choice. It's like, it's not a choice if you're broke and you have to decide between transit, rent, and food. Everyone always puts food as their last priority. That's why when I graduated, I wanted to work in community nutrition, helping those who are at risk or in need. And I did for a couple of years. I was starting to pay out of my paycheck to support the Payground program. I was like, no, 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 we can't do that. I love how I turn on the camera and start talking about the most random things with you guys. But somehow, when I read the comments, you guys seem to appreciate that. So I appreciate you for appreciating my weirdness. All right, let's just do these bottom lashes and let's go. I think he's put it in and make sure this is too dirty. It's too orange. Mm. I can't help it, I want you. I can't stop and look the other way. Cause I know it could be babe, and you never feel the same. Could be thinking about it every day. Don't believe in fairy tales, but we got a fantasies. And it's me and the sea. I need to know what climate, what city, what country or more specifically city is around 26 to 30 all year round and doesn't have a risk of hurricanes or tsunamis. I want to know because I need to live there. <laughs> Don't let me get on my soapbox, but look at the nail. She always does such a good job. She mixed a purple to make it very faint and sheer, just like I like it. So if you want someone who is super detailed, takes her time to get it perfect, like my nails have never looked so good. My cuticles are fresh AF. Check out Emma at Monlux. Catch the joke. So I'm asking the guy like, what is this cream about? Cause my doctor didn't explain it to me. I don't know why, every time I ask that question to a pharmacist, they light up. I guess people just ask for the simple basic stuff, but I wanna know, like, what does this do? Why was it prescribed to me? He's like, do you have a rash? I'm like, yep, right here. Showed him this and he's like, oh, it's interesting she prescribed this for you since it's not inflamed. I said, my doctor gives me the wrong prescription all the time. She's like, the worst. That's on record. I wanna cook, but I forgot that the thing that I wanna cook today involves an orange 
l'orange and some lime which it's up the the way you said to my eyes i know that i don't make this clear i fall for you every time i try to resist you we can get away on trees beach views with an every day all i want to hear is in the pictures on replay sit right next to you I am so hungry. I cannot wait to eat those tacos. They've been marinating for a few hours now. I keep checking the recipe because I swear last time I added cumin and scotch bonnet, even though carne asada is not a Jamaican dish. I add scotch bonnet to everything. But this time I put a neat and yeah, I don't even know how to pronounce it. I put that pepper on there because at least it's a Mexican pepper because I don't have jalapeno. So we'll see how it goes. But I'm like, no soy sauce? Like just lime and orange juice? I don't know guys. I'm kind of like, hmm. I like to try a different recipe every single time I make something I've made before until I find something that I can tweak and make perfectly. Ooh. Something about this is a vibe every single time. I'll never get bored of my diffuser. Why do I call it a diffuser? My diffuser fog. It's a whole vibe, especially at nighttime. Anyway, let me put this away. Still working on drinking more. So I got 10 minutes out until I have to log on to do some work. I know a couple of you guys have asked me, was work? And I think I told you guys a couple of vlogs ago, although not everybody watches every single vlog or watches every single moment of the vlog. So hopefully you're watching this part. I wish I could show you, but I have to record on Zoom because they send it into the company and I've done it for Spotify, Snapchat, Shopify. Today, I don't know what this company is. But pretty much the company I work for as a freelance is I do testing on their website to make sure that it functions, is accessible. We run through a setup. So they basically figure out the direction that I'm going to go. There's a word for it that is evading me. But they tell you where to go on the site and what to click and what to do. And you're supposed to fumble around and figure it out and let them know along the way what glitches come up or what problem you have. I do this from an accessibility point of view, so I'm trying to see as a visually impaired person where they can improve as far as magnification or contrast or larger font. And I don't mind it because I'm into tech, as you guys know already, and it pays pretty well. Although, because of the gig economy, people snatch up these things as soon as it's posted. I was getting my nails done and I had to tell the girl, hold up, let me just accept this, because that's how quick. There have been times where I just happen to be on my email because I don't get notifications on my phone like that. It's just too much. And then within 10 minutes, it was already gone. I think companies are really maximizing on this whole get it how you live it economy because you have 10 people doing what should be one full-time job. That's the way I see it. Done another one. I can't even show the company that I'm reviewing for this screen that's blurred out because the company I work for doesn't want anyone to know the layout. So that's how like it is. Super professional. The facilitator, he's A1 from day one. I'm hungry AF, so let's get these tacos on the go, especially since I need to go. I'm supposed to leave and what? Wow, I'm just flying. Let's go. You have to mysterious lately. I look in a mirror, make you go shy away. Hope I can see. Hard. 
can't. <laughs> Guys, it is a very gloomy day. You know, I do love me one of two of these ever so often, and we definitely need it because that grass is dry, dry, dry. Today is another busy day. What's new, no surprise. And an update on yesterday. So those tacos were good, but they still feel like they were missing something. Especially if I compare it to the carne. Oops. Oops, oops, oops. I was about to put <laughs> the coffee right in the water. It needs to be in the well. Get it together, girl. I went to bed a little after 12. I was actually texting and then I fell asleep and I woke up and I saw the person responded. Oopsie. That happens to me all the time. Do not text me after 10 o'clock because I cannot guarantee I will be awake or coherent to respond. Oh no, what a waste. As for yesterday, so yeah, the tacos were right. Then I went out for drinks. I think, oh, oh I thought I had it open up to town. I'm really not together today. If I didn't have my head on my neck today, I don't know what I would do. I'm all over the place, all over the place. So last night, the tacos were good, but like I said, I feel like it was missing something. So I'm gonna add cumin next time and maybe a little soy sauce. Cause it just didn't have that unami flavor. You know what I'm saying? They weren't bad. And I need to stop overcooking my beef. But the problem is when you can't see, you can't chance it either. Now I'm craving real tacos, like barrio tacos or El, Car El Carnita. No, I'm mixing two. Alcatrin and La Carnita have good tacos too. That's what I'm thinking of. That only took so many hours. It's okay. At least it's done. And the rain has stopped. The sun has come out a little bit. So maybe I should throw on some pants. Well, maybe it's too humid to wear pants. But I'll switch my outfit and run some errands. I really want, not this. I really want like a nice shower setup. I love this brand Umbra. It's so good. Morning. Happy Friday, Kaye. <laughs> Do you remember? Okay, maybe I'm really aging myself, but also making myself super nerdy. I used to be heavy into NSYNC back in the day. Anyway, why is this here? Oh, because I need to cut this mango that I've been meaning to cut for three days. I'm not supposed to be eating these anyway. Anywho, <laughs> back in the day, I was a huge NSYNC fan. I mean, they came out when I was like grade five or six, right? What was that Backstreet Boys? Why is there no foam? What is going on? Is this broken? Amazon? I need to speak with your manager. So, anywho, as I was saying, they had a song with their No Strings Attached album. I don't remember what it was called, but they said, like, yippee i kaye. <laughs> and me saying that today reminded me of... Pop music was bad. Let's just call a spade a spade. There are no classics. Like, who's really jamming to Bye 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 in 2022? If you are, I'm really looking at you. And then that has me thinking, because Division has been doing their little runarounds talking to different podcasts and they're on the Rory and Mall one which you guys know I love. Daniel, voice of an angel, speaking the most toxic-ish, but that's what's trending these days. I'm gonna make a podcast about it on Tuesday because there's so much context about why people keep moving to negativity instead of supporting positivity. Is this even on the right way? Okay, I'm wearing this because I'm gonna do a little TikTok. I'm not just dressed up in my house for nothing, but yeah. I'm gonna have some porridge. I'm super excited about my bin. This is how you know, adulting 101, you get excited about a bin. I might go back and get another one today, 20% off. Hey, these are so perfect for knowing what I'm pulling out when I can't see what the box says and being able to know when I'm running low because I can just open the door and be like, oh yeah, I can buy more beet chips or whatever it may be. It sounds like froth, no froth. Okay, don't tell me this is defective already. I'm like, what's that banging sound? Just the window cleaner. Never do this job, no matter how much someone paid me.
supposed to switch from my floor one time because I was wearing my heels inside and we don't do that in, in this house. We don't wear our shoes that are outside. Although some of those heels, I said, wow, it's different being legally blind. Because the last time I put these on, I could see. I don't know if I trust myself in these guy high heels. Those are crazy walking death sentences. hours would you believe that I went to three grocery stores that's why I didn't bring you guys along it would slow me down to try to get those aesthetic shots but I couldn't go to just one place to get everything I need because I went to one grocery store for mint and I have that I went to another one they had one left that was just not fresh and because I'm not using it to cook with I'm using it for drinks tomorrow it needs to be fresh then I wanted a portobello mushroom because the last two grocery stores I went to earlier this week also didn't have that these chips, because if you know me, they used to be my biggest, biggest guilty pleasure. There was a time when I was literally eating them every day. It's been a couple weeks since I've had chip chips, so of course, oat milk, when do I not? I can't remember if the 0% fat or if it's the vanilla one that froths, but we're going to test the frother tomorrow to make sure it still works. Otherwise, I'm going to have to order a new one. Some grapefruit Perrier, because if you ask me, this one and the peach one are the best flavors. Just saying. Some more avocados. Whew, two for four dollars. I never thought that would be a sale. But the day has come. No, some fish. Because I was like, hmm, what do I want for dinner? I want salmon. And then, of course, oh no, banana down. That's okay. If you're new to my vlog, you should know I'm a huge germaphobe to the point where I clean my house before people come and right when they leave. Even when I used to have house parties and people would leave at three, I would stay up until four cleaning because that's how much it bothers me. And then this many cherries cost $5 and that's called a sale, but I love me cherries. And again, tis the season. I wanted to get watermelon. Can someone tell me if $8 for watermelon is normal or six? Four quarter because I'm like how does that work that's how you know the type of neighborhood I live in receipt another two over there Let me put this in the fridge all right and I'm gonna put on a swimsuit even though I don't think I'm gonna swim because that's what we're gonna do tomorrow I'm gonna have some friends come over I want to take a dip in the pool actually maybe I should swim today because I'd probably be too busy with socializing okay. I did a little gym sesh. It wasn't what I thought it was because I try to do abs almost every single day. I'm trying to get back to where I used to be. Ay. 
and I was listening to Lovely T's pods about escorts and being flewed out. I thought it was so interesting. I'm so excited for today. It's a sunny Saturday. I'm always afraid when I plan an outside thing that it's going to be the one day of the week that it rained, but it rained quite a bit this week and today is just perfection. So I'm really happy about that. I'm going to edit my video for a little bit while I wait for him to come. I do. I was going to do a whole fruit platter and everything, but I don't know how often or how long they're going to stay up here. And we're not allowed to bring, I don't know if you guys can see me, we're not allowed to bring food downstairs, so I'm just going to put some cherries out. Obsessed with these. Cherry's the one fruit that I don't like mixed with anything. Like, I don't know if I'll like a cherry smoothie, for example, but I'm not big on cherry pie. Cherry candy reminds me of cough drops, you know? And what else has cherry in it? I can't think, because it's not really the thing you mix with other things. Like pineapple goes with everything. Mango overtakes everything. Banana is the base for almost every smoothie. Yo, I had this thought, because I was talking to my cousin last night about Bop, which was a magazine that had all the boy bands in their O-Town, NSYNC, Backstreet Boys. Why did we spend money on this foolishness? If you were to show a magazine like that to today's preteen, they'd be like, why do you buy this? Their pictures are on Instagram. Why would you pay for this? And then it had me thinking how many things that an 80s baby, 90s kid would think was so cool back in the day that an odds child or a 20, 20 something kid in five years or even like a preteen right now would be like, what is this? Why did you guys like it? Like the Twisted Bop It game, they'd be like, pass me, a Nintendo Switch. Like, give me something real to work with. Did you get COVID ever? No, not yet. Oh. We didn't forget about anything. This guy is super. I don't even know if it's recorded because I can't tell. Oh, Alicia. No, record your, your bad ways. You're laughing. I'm so sorry. You're not sorry at all. You're sorry you got caught. Last one of the night. What? There's not even it's a. It's a baby thing. shot. No. This is not. No. Seriously. No, I can't pour. I can't see. There's really nothing in this. Well, like, I'm blind and I can't drink, so two things work together. Actually, charging this time around now. Yeah, it is. Good. 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 I forgot. I don't know the title. Good. 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 Good.